let's yeah. let's do a test on the sound. Will you hear the sound? Testing. One, two, three. Testing. One, two, three. Testing.
Welcome everybody, welcome to the season opener of Foxborough Varsity Boys Hockey 21-22 season campaign. Tonight we have the visiting Northbridge Rams against the home Foxborough Warriors. We're sitting here at Foxborough Sports Center and we have an entirely full house. So nice to see a uh, big crowd out tonight. Obviously last year was a little bit different circumstances where I uh, played under some uh, restricted and uh, we really didn't have the ability to have fans. So uh, looking forward to bringing the season to you. My name is Keith Leach and uh, I'm joined on camera here by Chris Vasella. Teams are just wrapping up the warm-ups and we'll get ready for the pregame festivities. Getting close here, both teams now doing their traditional uh, meeting in front of the nets. Huge air of excitement right now for uh, game one. Really excited for the, uh, the season to get started. We'll let the uh, announcers take it away.
All right, here we go. Getting ready for puck drop. Pre-game festivities highlighted by just a heartfelt tribute from Bill Feeney to Kristen Warrius and the Warrius family. The Foxborough High School boys team has committed to honoring Kristen and dedicating the system to Kristen Warrius. Our national anthem was sang by Ella Warrius. She did a very nice job. And you feel the anticipation in the ring. Everybody's ready to put, drop the puck on this season. Starting for Foxborough, pretty much an all-senior lineup. We'll have that center, number 17, Matt Grace. On the left wing, number 19, Captain Jack Watts. On the right side, senior Tom Marcusella. On defense, we've got number 26, Brady Callahan. Number 10, Dylan Pothier. In net, number 29, senior Josh Marcoux. And the players in the way. Foxborough's got the puck in deep early. That's Watts in the corner, battling hard. Callahan's able to keep it at the line. Grace is in the corner, working it from behind the net. Matt Grace works it back to Dylan Pothier. Pothier off the sideboard. Back to Callahan, shot on net, just goes wide. Good pressure early here by the Warriors. Watts working it in the corner. I'm going to do my best right now to help uh, support some of the names on the Northbridge team. That's Flanders moves it up. Lewis, stolen by Watts. In front, an early opportunity. Oh, just missed. Good save by the uh, Northbridge goaltender. Shot by uh, Tom Marcusella. Nice pressure early by the Warriors. Right away, getting the puck, driving control down into the Northbridge zone. Looks like a nice quick start. At center right now, we have Ben Ricketts. Work in the corner. Kept in at the line by Sullivan Keneally. Again, battle at the line. Northbridge is able to get it out. Northbridge coming into the Foxborough zone. Harrington. Now it's on Marino's stick. Working it back into the corner. That's Harrington. Oh, nice body check there by Kilviello. It's worked up the boards and out of the zone. Now it's a neutral zone carried by Kanji. Again, I'm going to do my best to help uh, say, the, say the names right of uh, Northboro. It's worked out of the end by Coviello. Up the boards to Derek Axon. It's kept in high at the, at the slot and dumped in deep. Keneally in pursuit. And now Ricketts has the puck behind the Foxboro net. He's working up the side boards. He's got it up to Derek Axon. Axon clears the zone. He's going to dump it in deep on goal. We've got a line change now going for Foxboro as Axon works the puck. Good forecheck by Axon. He's able to control it. It's coming in the slot. Jack Watts now in pursuit. He's got the puck behind the net. Watts is dangling and looks. He's got Pothier at the point. Back to Watts in the high slot. Oh, and it's blocked. Nice block there by uh, number nine on, uh, on Northbridge. Watts in behind the net. Works it. Clean to Marcusella. Watts now behind the net. Watch to the point, Pothier with the shot, and it's got a partial block, and it's cleared out of the zone. Pothier grabs the puck deep in his zone, circles the net, looking for Marcusell up the board, he's got him. Marcusell's coming out of the zone, looks like about a three on two entry here. Watts, Watts dumps it into the corner. Watts behind the net, in control, looks back to Pothier, there's a shot on net, there's a rebound. Nice save by the uh, Northbridge goaltender. And it's dumped all the way down the ice on to Marcus Sully. He'll have to play the puck. That's Pothier behind the net. Up, up to Connor Hayes. That's Hayes with the puck. He looks up forward. He's got Axon. And Northbridge breaks it up. Broken up by Flanders of Northbridge. Flanders wins the puck on the board. Flanders is coming up the side. He drops it into the slot to Numella. He gets a shot. Good save by Marcou. Battle going on behind the net. Connor Hayes works it. Connor Hayes is working up the board. Good little battle on the side net. Ricketts in to help. Puck's held on the line. It's shot in on Marcusella. Makes a nice save. Axon turning back. Intercepted and turned over in the neutral zone by Numella. Hayes now picked up by Pothier. Oh, intercepted. We got a one on one. Oh, 19 coming in all alone. And he's able to knock it in. Little, little breakdown, that's Joe Sullivan, number 19 of Northbridge, 
Open your season with the first goal. This is a neutral zone turnover. Sullivan was able to take advantage, worked a one on one, made a very nice deep move on Marcus Sala. Here we go, early in the first. Northbridge gets on the board first, one nothing. Good fast pace to the uh, to the start of the season. Both teams look like they're ready to play. Looks like it should be a pretty uh, even battle. That's Keneally. Keneally comes over the line. That's Matt Grace in pursuit. Matt Grace. Oh, Watts with a nice close in shot. Watts with a nice body, wins the puck. Moving to the high slot, drops it low to Grace. Gracie again. Oh, he gets two chances at it. Nice work down low uh, from a low up to high play by Jack Watts in front. And uh, Matt Grace on the doorstep gets a couple shots at it. That's Zach Menard playing goal for Northbridge. And so far he's looked very sharp. Seen a lot of shots. Grace wins the draw. Watts with the rebound. It's live. It's there. Oh, uh -huh. and Menard's able to cover it up. But again, nice pressure. Foxborough winning the draw, driving puck to the net. <laughs> we go, but we got 10.52 left in the first period. one nothing Northbridge. Matt Grace at the draw versus number 24, which is Evan Harrigan of Northbridge. Northbridge wins that draw. It's at the point. They've won it through. We could have a two-on-one developing. Shot from the far right side goes a little bit wide. Here we go, puck is turned around. Turnover, turnover to center to Marino. Interrupted and shot down deep by Marcusella. Pressure's on. Marcusella almost wins the battle at the top of the circle. It's turned over and number nine ret retreats into the uh, Foxborough zone for Northbridge. Apologize, I don't have a number nine on our roster here for Northbridge. Puck's moved up. Matt Grace got the puck on the left side, coming in, gets a shot away, a little high over the net. Puck comes out of the zone, covered by Jack Watts. Fox for a regroup. Turned over at the uh, neutral zone. That's Cody Kachuk, who's tipped it into the Foxborough zone. Turned back by Brady Callahan. Dumped in deep to the Northbridge zone. Derek Lewis of Northbridge moving the puck out. He moves that up the side wall, but it's a turnover. Pothier coming in. Pothier coming in from the left side. Drops in slot. Connor Hayes with a nice opportunity. Yet another great save by Zach Menard. <coughs> Northbridge now working the puck. Down in the Foxborough zone. That's Flanders. It's broken up nicely. Broken up nicely there by uh, Derek Axon. Does a nice little job of back checking. Uh, helping out with some defensive play. Good start to the uh, pace of the game. Nine minutes, 24 seconds remaining in the first period. one nothing Northbridge. Um, we've seen a nice, uh, a nice quick start. Foxborough's had some real good uh, pressure down deep, getting some good opportunities, just haven't had the chance to uh, break through um, young Menard in net for Northbridge. Draws one by Northbridge. Back to the point. Moving to the high. Shots blocked. Recouped by Poftier for a moment. And blowing down. It looks like we had a high stick. You can tell there was a few nerves at the beginning of the game, but uh, I have to say they settled in pretty quickly. And again, we've got a really good pace. Good back and forth game here for the uh, season opener. Pucks one deep. Poth here in the corner. So we did have a penalty on the play. Uh, Derek Axon of Foxborough was called for hooking. So he'll be off for uh, two minutes or less. So this is Northbridge working a power play. Northbridge working into the zone. That's Numella. Nice block. Nice block turned around by Watts. Got a, got a race for the puck here. Nice job by Grace. It's broken up. Patrick Schraft breaks it back for Northbridge. He enters the Foxborough zone. Going behind the net. Sets up while he drops in front. That's nicely broken up by uh, Watts. Watts now in pursuit. Short-handed. Northbridge had to, had to feel the pressure and they turned it out. That's Patrick Schraft. Schraft moving in for Northbridge. He decides to take a shot. The rebound goes into the corner. Coviello's now got it. 
Moves it up the sidewall, inter intercepted by Numella. Jack Watts, Watts in the corner, dumps it out, just wants to clear the zone, try to work some of those seconds off on the shorthanded situation. Dumped back in by Northbridge. Numella dumps it deep. Marcuse stops it. Flanders, in behind the net. Moves it over to Marino, and that's dumped out. Dumped out nicely. That's going to help kill some more of the seconds. 21 seconds remaining on the power play for Northbridge. Dumped in deep by Harrigan. It is an icing. Oh, that's a bit of a mistake for Northbridge. I don't think they, uh, they intended to do that on the power play. I think they just meant to get it in, try to get possession, but he didn't clear the red zone, so it's called for an icing. 11 seconds remaining on the power play for Northbridge. Face-offs in deep in Northbridge zone. Taking the draw for Foxborough is Ben Ricketts. Ben Ricketts draws one by Northbridge. Good pressure by Ricketts though. Again, they just want to kill these last few seconds. <laughs> Ricketts in pursuit, in the neutral zone. And the penalty has now expired. Foxborough is now back to full strength and we're playing five on five hockey. Puck comes across the neutral zone, intercepted by Pothier, but it's offside. So Foxborough was able to kill their first penalty of the season. Not a whole lot of big pressure. Um, they did a nice job of boxing them out. Uh, one possession and got it deep, so um, Northbridge really didn't break through with any real threatening opportunities. Pucks won, back to Pothier, dumped in across the blue line. Hayes in pursuit. Puck is taken over by Northbridge. Running up the side here is De Silva. Dumped in. That's Poth here. It's back to the point. They get a good shot on that. Great save by Josh Marcou. Got a really nice save on that one. Puck went through a few sets of legs, a little bit of a screen, but Josh was up to the task. We're at 6.48 remaining in the first period. 1-0 Northbridge in uh, what's been a well-contested first period so far. Draw just outside the blue line. Draws one, tucked in deep, but possession taken by Foxborough. Keneally turns the puck over. De Silva's got it. He puts it in front to number nine. Shot from the point, and Marcou has it again. Good eyes on that shot, Marcou. Not only does he make the save, but he does not give up any rebound opportunity, which is critical. So we got a draw here. We'll be on the left side of Marcou, down in Foxborough zone. Puck is won by Foxborough. Here comes Watts. He's got a ton of speed. Oh, just broken up nicely at the blue line. Northborough. Excuse me, Northbridge. Putting it D to D. Still playing with the zone. Oh, there's a turnover right in the slot. Just bounced off the stick of Watts. Coviello moves the puck up to Marcusella. Coviello's got it again. He's going to put it in deep. Nice play. Dumps it in deep. Now they can get the four check started. Puck's turned out. Long play. Dumped in deep by Numella. We've got a penalty on the play here. It looks like number six, Jack Numella of Northbridge, is going to go into the box. So this is going to be the first power play opportunity of the season for Foxborough. And bringing out the number one power play unit, which looks like that'll be the first line, which is Watts, Matt Grace, Tom Marcusella, Sullivan Keneally, and Dylan Pothier on the point. Nice draw by Grace. Wins it. Over to Pothier. Shot on net. Oh, nice play. Good save again by Menard. Nice draw win there by Grace. Gets it back to the point to Keneally. He deeds it, deeds it over to uh, Pothier and they get a nice shot on net. Probably just need to get a little more traffic in front of Menard. Seems to be seeing the puck. Puck is won by Grace. That's Watts. Rolls off the stick. It's coming out to the neutral zone. They'll have to regroup. Watts is entering the zone. Watts tries to win the one-on-one -on -one battle. He's broken up and cleared down the ice. Marcuse out of his net. He's going to play that puck. 
They're going to want to get this puck moving quickly. Marcou plays it to Grace. Grace going to regroup behind his net. Comes Matt Grace breaking out. Captain Matt Grace able to break through. They're not the neutral zone. Dumped in by Marcusella. Jack Watson pursuit. <laughs> Kept it at the point. Marcusella's got it high. Do oh, drops it down to Grace. Just misses. And it's cleared down the ice by Northbridge. Minute five left in the power play. Fox Rose regrouping. That's Sullivan Keneally behind his net. He'll get the play started. Leaves it for Matt Grace. It's Grace working out of his end. Up the wing to Watts. Watts now clears the blue line. Watts is moving in. He's taking it in deep. He's still got possession. Trying to set up a play here. Watts drops it in the corner to Grace. Grace moves it back around to Watts. Watts has got control. Comes off the sidewall. Nice play. There's a rebound. Oh, very close. Good save again by Nubella. Nice setup by Watts in front. And it just missed the opportunity to bang home the rebound. Sullivan Keneally working behind his net. Keneally, nice job of baking off the uh, pressure by Northbridge player. Unfortunately, that will be an icing. So tons of action here. Both teams have had a power play. Fox Rose has got 22 seconds left on their power play right now. Four minutes, 12 seconds left in the first period. And we have a one nothing score in favor of the visitors from Northbridge. Draws one back to the point on Marcou. Has no problems. Able to not only make the save, but steer it away into the corner. Ricketts behind the net. Oh, turnover. But they're able to, Callahan's able to, to win control back in his corner. Over to Coviello. Coviello's moving up. Long pass up the side to Hayes. Hayes is working the puck in deep. Nicely done. Hayes wins the puck behind the net in front. Just misses Ricketts. Good opportunity, good look. Derek Axon with a shot on net. Northbridge is just going to relieve the pressure. No icing as the puck did go on net. Marcus is going to cover it up. So with 3.31 left, we'll have a draw down deep into the Foxborough zone. Foxborough had some nice pressure there. Northbridge just had to uh, kind of release it and uh, shot the puck deep down into the Foxborough zone. Puck is one in the corner, flipped over by Callahan. Up the boards to Axon. Axon up the wall, it's kept in. Puck bounces right to the slot. Shot by a number 26, Connor De Silva, but a nice save by Josh Marcoux. Marcoux looked fairly sharp here in the first period. Only puck to beat him was a uh, one, on, uh, one on breakaway. Here comes Ben Ricketts in the zone. Nice shot, that could go. We're gonna have to have a look here. That might have been in. Referees are going to have a discussion. <clears throat> There's been no signal yet. Nice screenshot by Ricketts. Puck fell below the goaltender. Looks like... Puck's going outside. The puck didn't clear the goal line. Nice opportunity there by Ben Ricketts. I really liked how he used the defenseman as a screen. And it did give De Silva some, sorry, gave Menard, uh, excuse me, some problems. Puck one back to Keneally. Over to Pothier. Moves it up the wall. Hayes into the middle. Gets a shot on net. Saved by Menard. Puck's out of play. 2.51 left in the first period. Foxborough continues to drive pressure. Uh, getting some nice shots on net. Just looking for an opportunity to beat young Zach Menard. We got, we got a freshman, Brett Axon, taking the draw here. He's got Stephen Bridges on the wing and Henry Diamond on the other wing. Looks like we're getting a third line opportunity here. Getting a little bit of pressure coming in from the uh, from a new a new line. And the puck is down the ice, and that's an icing by Northbridge. So yes, we've got Steve Bridges, who's a senior, number 25, with freshman Brett Axon, the brother of Derek Axon, that's center and Henry Diamond, who's a junior, playing on the right side with Keneally and Pothier on the point. Axon at the draw. One by Northbridge. Dumped in their corner, up the wall. Steven Bridges able to keep that in. Nice, nice stick by Steve Bridges. Steven in, in pursuit behind the net. 
Buck is tipped, and that would have been an icing, but again, gee, I think that's about the third time. I don't know if Northbridge is doing it on purpose, but they've been able to dump it, which would be icing, but they're able to get it on the goal, which will uh, wave that off. So, the puck's going to be down deep in the Foxborough zone. 2.23 left here in the first. Got Grayson at the draw right now. Grace wins the draw. It's up the wall, but it's kept in by uh, Northridge. Turned over. Grace. Back to Callahan. Up the wall to Watts. Turned over. Turned over. Here comes Northridge with an opportunity in the slot. Nicely broken up by Dylan Pothier at the point. Watts. Oh, it's turned over again. Uh, I think Cedarcheck, Mr. Mark Cedarcheck, might have a word with the boys in the first period on the turnovers just inside their zone. Good opportunity there by Mark Casella coming into the zone. Mark Casella behind the net. Oh, he's tripped. Yeah, the referee's got that. So that's it. Mark Casella drew a penalty. He was tripped by the Northbridge player. So Foxborough goes right back to the power play here late in the period. Opportunity to try to square it up. That's Derek Consigli who's taking the tripping penalty for Northbridge. Derek Consigli, a junior of Northbridge. So Foxborough goes back on a power play with 142 left in the first period. Puck is one. Back to Watts. It's over to Coviello. He takes a look. He's got room. Nice shot. Nice save. Watts has the rebound though. Watts has control. Watts in the corner has control. Working his way behind the net. Looking for an opening. Drops it in the corner to Keneally. Keneally over to Watts. Watts with it high. Moves it over to Coviello. Coviello tries to go cross ice. Pucks through but doesn't find a Fox Rose stick. Watts high at the point. To Keneally on the sidewall. To Watts. He's in a good spot. He hit the outside of the post. Great opportunity. Good look there off the outside of the post. That's Grace. Back to Keneally. Back to Watts. Back to Keneally. Oh, Marcusella with a tip, but another save. Battle at the point. It does get out. It's brought out by number 28, Chase Falcon of Northbridge. Keneally up to Marcusella. 39 seconds left in the power play, in the period, excuse me. Watts off the side, tries the short side. Doesn't go. Bernard was up to the task. And the puck comes out to neutral zone. Callahan, they've got time left here. they got 25 seconds. Try to enter the zone again. Watts dumps it in. Watson dumps it in. It's turned around by Northbridge. But almost kept into the point by Callahan. It's Marcus Sella with 11 seconds left in the first period. Moves it up. That's Ben Ricketts. Loses control at the blue line. Northbridge will clear it for the release of the pressure. Down the ice by De Silva. That should do it for the first period. Well, there you have it. First period of the new season. Great, great period of play. Um, good pace. Uh, pretty well, uh, well balanced. Foxborough probably had a little bit more possession time down deep in the zone. Probably led in shots. I don't have a shot clock right now. Uh, but we have a one nothing Northbridge lead after one. With that, we'll sign off for the first period, and we'll join you back uh, as we get ready to start the second.
All right, we're back for the second period. It's Matt Grace, top of the slot. He's got a good look there. Put it down low to Watts. Big battle in the corner. Watts comes out with it. Drives it. It's at the net, but couldn't quite break through. Foxborough has put lots of pressure on uh, the Northbridge goaltender, Zach Menard, but he's so far, he's answered every, uh, every threat. Puck's coming outside. Usually the puck comes outside if uh, the puck went, that might have been shoved off by a Foxborough player, or we might have had a defenseman from Foxborough come in deep on the play. But the draw is coming outside. Draw one back to Callahan. High stick, heads up, coming our way. Luckily, didn't get any of the fans. Just getting underway here in the second period. Only 26 seconds in, draw goes back to center ice as the puck went over the glass. It's Northbridge with the puck. Bell at the top of the blue line. Matt Grace dumps it. It is going to go all the way. No icing on the play. Icing's waved off. That's retrieved by number eight, Derek Lewis. Lewis carrying the puck out. Goes up the wall. No, it's turned over at center ice. Jack Namella. Namella's coming in. Now it comes up the board. Takes it in deep. Gets a good look in front. It's now cleared into the neutral zone. Lewis moves the puck over, up the side wall. That's going to be Flanders in pursuit, but it will go for an icing. So it's an icing call. It'll come all the way back deep into the Northbridge zone. And once again, we have a full house here in Foxborough Sports Center. It's even standing remotely on some of the uh, student body down in the far corner. Puck is won by Northbridge. They're coming in deep. Puck's coming in. Marcus, uh, uh, excuse me. Mark, Marcou will cover that up. Josh Marcou is able to cover that puck. Josh looked sharp in the first period. Only got beat once and it was on a breakaway. Puck's in deep. Box pro zone. Ben Ricketts wins the draw. Back to Sullivan Keneally. Keneally goes D to D over to Coviello. Coviello chips it up the board. Ben Ricks, it turns it over at neutral zone. Battling at the neutral zone. Good battle. Won by Ricketts. Ricketts has cut. Oh, it loses the puck, but Coviello at the point. Just came outside the blue line. They'll have to regroup. Puck shot in deep. Fox World players have to clear the blue line as uh, it was a delayed offside. Comes up the board. Working up the wall was Lewis, intercepted by Keneally at mid-ice. Mid Keneally dumps it in deep. Lewis, for Northbridge, works it up the wall. Chipped off Ricketts. Turned back over. And Northbridge will turn it out. That's Falcon. Falcon moving the puck into the middle. Oh! That is a solid mid-ice hit. Keneally on Falcon. And we also had Ben Ricketts in the collision too. Let's hope that young fellow is uh, is okay. It was a clean hit. He might have just got the wind knocked out of him. Pretty heavy collision at mid ice. He's up. He's up and okay. That's just uh, like I said, a good solid hit. Probably got slightly winded, but uh, good good body check, clean body check by Sullivan Keneally across the middle ice. No penalties on the play. Looks like no injuries, so we'll be ready to drop the puck and get her going again. Yeah, Matt Grace, captain, senior captain, taking the draw. Just to the right side of Josh Marcou. The referee's lining him up, letting him know how he's going to drop the puck. Keep it a clean draw. And we're off and running. Pucks won by Grace into the corner. 
Callahan, oh, it goes off the wall. Pothier out. Mark, uh, Marcus Suggs, excuse me, into the middle. And Matt Grace coming up to center. He's in deep now. He triggers, takes a shot from the far side. Brings it all the way around. Keneally picks up, does a nice tip. Tip, but doesn't quite go. Watts has got it. Off the wall. Good look. There's a goal. Goal for Foxborough. First goal of the season. Scored by number 19, Jack Watts. But we'll listen for the official assists on the play. Watts took a nice play off the side wall, got to the high slot. He's got a really strong shot. And Fox was able to finally break through on Zach Menard. And we've got a tie game 1 1 here with 12 21 left in the second period. Puck is won by Grace to Callahan. Picked up by Northbridge. Callahan in the neutral zone. Won and dumped in deep by De Silva. Puck dropped in deep. Marcuse got it. Drops it for Pothier. Dylan Pothier up the side wall. Won't go out. Now Pothier again. To Grace. To Watts again. So that goal was, as we said, Jack Watts, first goal of the season, assisted by number 17, Matt Grace. Watts from Grace, and we're tied at one. Good battles here at the top of the blue line. Grace has got it, he's gonna throw it in deep. Deep into the corner. That's retrieved by Schraft. Dumped in by Kachuk, now oh! Matt Grace has another look in front of the high slot. Watts again. This line continues to put the pressure on. And it's just dumped up high in the glass. So we had that first goal, and same line kept the pressure coming. And Matt Grace had a nice look there in the high slot. But it still remains 1-1, 11-22 remaining in the second period. We're about halfway through the game here. Again, well contested. Bucksboro's carried a little bit more of the play, I would say. They've had a little more puck possession. Higher shot count. Uh, but we are tied at one. Keneally at the, up the top of the blue line. He does keep that in. That's dumped in deep. That's freshman. Uh, freshman Bright Axon. Axon. Back to Keneally. Oh, he's going, he was going D to D, but it went outside the blue line. Coviello calmly recoups it. Throws it up the, the gut. That's to Diamond. That's to Brett Axon. Again, freshman Brett Axon gets it on net. Nice play by Axon. There is a rebound, but it's cleared out by Northbridge. Uh, they're waving that off, so that is not going to be icing. Keneally's got it behind the net. Drops it to Coviello, brings it back to his defense partner, Keneally. Keneally's in control, takes it behind the net. Up the side wall for Steve Bridges. It's shipped over to Brett Axon. Axon coming in. He's going to put that on net. Nicely done. And Steven Bridges is going to win the battle of the puck. Bridges pump, pokes it behind the net. Up the side wall. Rick gets pursuit, but Northbridge is able to clear it out. It's over to number 19. Sullivan. But it's intercepted. Bridges has got it. Breaks it up. Up the middle of the Ricketts. Ricketts carrying it in. He'll dump that in the corner. Turned back over by number five, Consiglio. That's Henry Diamond behind the net. Oh, runs into a battle on the wall with Lewis. Ricketts has got it behind the net. He's got Callahan high. It goes through. Gets through the legs of Bridges. But Zach Menard was able to be on the spot and make the save. Still a good battle down low. Comes up to Callahan. Good look by Callahan. He's got Ricketts in the slot, and he pumps it in the top corner. That's 2-1 Foxborough. Nice puck control by Foxborough. We get a high play up to the slot to Callahan. Callahan dumps it in, high slot, picked up by Ben Ricketts, who finds the top shelf over the glove of Zach Menard. 9.41 left in the second. Foxborough has just went ahead. 2-1. to one. Oh, Looks like Foxborough is starting to build on the momentum. As I said, they're starting to carry most of the uh, puck control. I'm going to call Ricketts from Brady Callahan, but we'll wait for the official announcement from the uh, scorers. That's Pothier. Number 26, Brady Callahan, and number 10, Dylan Pavier. 
Yeah, so as we said, it was Ben Ricketts. First assist going to Brady Callahan. The second assist going to Dylan Pothier. Nice play by Foxborough. They had nice puck possession. They turned it into an opportunity, and they made good on it. Up 2-1. Puck's turned over at center ice. Foxborough's looking good here in pursuit. That's Derek, that's, uh, Derek Axon. Now to Hayes. Connor Hayes turns it over. It's flushed into the middle. Now taken by Sullivan Keneally. Keneally, nice hit, nice work. Oh, and he hit, he, he takes a shot in the net, but he's ready for it. The physical play has started to pick up. Definitely see more body checks here in the second period. And all of the clean nature, so it's just a good physical play uh, from both sides. That's taken behind the net. Taken behind the net by uh, number 27, Schraft. It just gets out of the zone, but uh, Jack Watts recoups. Watts is turning over. Oh, it looks like we're going to have an interference call. No, we've got a trip. So a trip in the neutral zone. Just as Foxborough had taken possession, um, it's going to be Derek Axon going to the box. Derek Axon is going to get called for the trip. So Foxborough is going to be short for two minutes or less. Look for an opportunity to kill the uh, second up, uh, power play of Northbridge for the night. Buck's going to come deep. It's on the right side of Josh Marcoux. Got Matt Grace, Keneally, Watts, and Coviello killing this penalty. Buck's in the corner up high, Watts, and Keneally's able to clear it down. Watts has got a beat on it. He's going to put pressure. He does win the battle. Watts has got it behind the net. Just killing a little time. Comes off the side. Well, gets a good look. Gets a shot. Gets a shorthanded shot. Well done by Watts as he takes control and he's able to bring it to the high slot. About eight minutes, one second left in the second period. One minute and 40 seconds left on the penalty to Foxborough. And a 2-1 lead for Foxborough. Bucks won by Northbridge. They're working it up the wall. Working up the wall is uh, number 19. Sullivan takes a shot. Marcuse got it. Chips it off the stick and wide. Grace clears it, but not out. It's held in at the point, but a nice deflection at the high slot at the high uh, point. Excuse me, by Matt Grace. That's 19. That's Sullivan. Sullivan has control. Looking to set it up. Sullivan again. He drops that off to Flanders. Flanders circles, circles. Has a look still circling. Flanders has control. He's battled by Keneally. Goes back to the point. Back to the point to number six, Numa, Numa. Flanders now on it. Numa's, excuse me. And Watts takes control off the glass, but kept in and a nice play. Numella with a look, misses the top of the net. Nice play at the point by Numella to glove that down and get a good shot on net. It's turned over and out of the zone. Now taken and dumped in deep by Sullivan. 35 seconds left in the power play. It's caught up in Marcuse skate. Oh, got a little drama there. All right, it looks like the whistle went before uh, that was cleared. Wow, what a play. The puck came off the back wall. It literally got caught up in uh, Marcuse skate. And fortunately for Josh, he was able to just control it and uh, disaster didn't take place. What a strange play. But he showed good patience there, didn't panic. And they were able to cover it up. So it remains 2-1, Foxborough. 29 seconds left in the penalty here. Uh, so Northbridge is trying to put a uh, little more pressure on while they have the man advantage. Puck is won by Ricketts. That's back to the point. Gets all the way through, but Mark Hume makes a great save. Shot by Patrick Schraft and threw some bodies, but you know, Mark Hume had a good eye on it. Made a great save. 24 seconds left. Puck is won. It's taken control by Northbridge. It's out and it's back in. Pothier has some time and he's able to clear it down deep. It's going to be oh, good body check behind the net. That's Schraft and Hayes. Puck goes all the way down the ice. That should be an icing. 6.23. Left in the second period, 2-1 to one for the hometown Foxborough Warriors. And they are killing off their second penalty of the night with only two seconds remaining. 
and the draw is going to go all the way down deep into the Northbridge zone. For game one, it's been quite physical, and it's been a good, a good clean physical. Uh, both teams using the body well, and as I said, um, within the rules, so we're not seeing any any uh, play that's going to break out in anything significant. Pucks turned over. That's Northbridge. Pressure's on by Ricketts. Ricketts wins the battle. Still got the puck. Good work by Ben Ricketts. It's turned over, and number 13, Marino, was able to just chip it outside the zone. Pucks in the neutral zone. It's carried up by number five, Kaniji. Kaniji, he's coming up the side. Puck on net. Marcus got it. There's no rebound. Nice coverage by Marku. So that was a nice little chip up the wall to Kaniji of Northbridge. And again, I apologize if I'm not pronouncing the name right. But nice little play up the left wall. Gets a good low shot. Marku to the task. Marku does not give up a rebound. The draw is to the uh, left of Marku, deep in the Foxborough zone. Matt Grace taking the draw. Matt Grace is able to win it. To Keneally. Up to Marcusella. Over to Watts. Watts coming in. Watts hits the high slot. He gets a good shot. Nice save by Menard. Pucks in deep. Keneally's got it. Nice little physical play in the, in the corner. Student body likes it. There's another hit. Oh, we do. We may have a penalty on this one. Well, we've got. We do have a call coming out of that. I do believe. Let's just wait and see. Calls being made by the referee. He did have the signal up for an elbow. Whoever the guilty party is doesn't want to go to the box. Waiting for the call. The referee seems to be asking what number. And it's going to be Tom Marcusella. Marcusella gets an elbow there. The play did start to get a little bit rough. But clearly, the hometown crowd does not like the call, nor does Marcusella himself. But in any case, it's going to be uh, another power play here for Northbridge. 5.32 left in the first period. So they'll be on the power play uh, for two minutes or less. Puck is won by them. Puck is in front. It looks like it got in the gear of uh, Matt Grace. Puck being in the gear, they'll blow it down. This is the third power play for Northbridge in the game. Draws run by Northbridge. Thrown in deep. 28 Falcons got it. He chips it over to Flanders. Flanders gets a shot. It's blocked nicely by Keneally. Pucks to the top of the circle. Grace wins it. It's in the neutral zone. Flanders has got control. Good back pressure by Matt Grace. And able to turn it over. Watts takes it off the glass and dumps it in deep. Derek Lewis, is, Lewis excuse me, for Northbridge. Up to the neutral zone, but it's turned over and dumped in by Sullivan Keneally. Physical plays picking up once again here in the second period. Over the line. Northbridge dumps it in. That's Sullivan. Turned over to Coviello. Flanders. Nice little chip just at the top of the blue line, which allows them to uh, have to backtrack. Takes some seconds off the clock on the, on the penalty kill. Again, couldn't break through at the top of the circle. That's Watts. Watts coming in one-on-one, -on -one, shorthanded. Gets a pretty good shot away. Puck comes off the wall. Ricketts is able to win the battle. Ricketts taking control of the puck behind his own net. That's Ben Ricketts up the wall, and it's out. Clears the blue line. Watts with good pressure, almost took it over. Now taken over by number six. Numella. Numella puts it in deep. That's Ricketts. Brady Callahan now has the puck in his own corner. Callahan takes control. Tried to put it up off the glass. Got it a little high. It's up and out of play. 3.50 remaining in the second period. 2-1 to Foxborough. Foxborough with two goals here in the second period to take the lead. And they are now clinging off their third shorthand or third power play. So their third shorthand of the evening. And there's 18 seconds left on that power play.
We'll have a redo at the draw there. Referee dropped it, blew the whistle, felt there was an unfair draw, so they'll redo it over again. Ben Ricketts taking the draw for Foxborough at center ice. He's taking that draw uh, against number nine again. I don't have on the roster. I apologize. Um, so it's Ricketts. And Ricketts wins the draw. Chips it up. Derek Axon has got some time. He's going to kill some clock. Throws it in deep. Oh, what a good bounce off the wall. It gets to Ricketts, but he doesn't get an opportunity for a shot. It's carried up by Kachuk. Kachuk dumps it in deep. Dylan Pothier takes the puck. It's up the wall. Intercepted. The number nine. Taken over by number 26, De Silva. That's Northbridge in deep. Back pressure by Pothier. Ricketts up the wall. He's got Hayes. Hayes is bringing it over the red line, over the blue line. Hayes on the side, takes it into the corner, but it's turned over and chipped away by Schraft. Turned back over and turned dumped in deep by Derek uh, Axon. Good pressure by Connor Hayes. Out to Axon in front, gets a backhand. Ricketts gets it back. He's got the rebound, and it's just over the net. Looks like we're looking for the puck. It's on the back mesh, and that'll get blown down. Some good pressure there by Foxrow at the end of the uh, killing off the penalty. Uh, able to take control. Looked like we had Connor Hayes did a nice job of winning the puck in the corner. Threw it in front. Ricketts got a piece of it, but just went over the net. Because the puck went on the back of the net, it was last touched by Foxborough. They'll bring the draw outside the blue line. 2.45 left in the second period. Ben Ricketts on the, on the draw. He wins it. He pushes it forward. So that's going to put some pressure on number five, Consiglia. 28, Falcon picks it up. He looks up the wall long. He does have number 13, Marino, but it's turned over. Derek Axon. Derek Axon. Dumps it in deep, gets a shot on net, steered away by Kanji. Back to the point, Keneally. Connor Hayes takes a shot, it goes wide. Grace is on the puck. Grace has got control, looking for Axon in front, just a little bit away from his backhand. Grace has got it again. Axon now has it. Axon behind the net, he takes a shot on net from behind, but it's turned away by Kanji. It's turned over again. Axon once again. Boxborough continues to put the pressure on. Axon looks in front. It goes off the defenseman. Cleared and out. Bring up the wall, but turned over at center, at mid center ice again. Alex Coviello moves it up the wall to Axon. Axon tries to chip it in deep. Doesn't get it all the way down. But that's turned over. And turned over by Kachuk. Moves it up to number 28, Falcon. Falcon takes a shot, but they are offside. Seen some really good pressure on the last two, three shifts here by Foxborough. Doing a nice job of puck control, um, doing some nice cycling, uh, low to high, getting some shots through. Uh, just haven't been able to break through the twine. Draws one by Grace. Got Jack Watts. Watts has the puck at neutral zone, carrying the puck. It's returned over by number 19. Shot on Marcou, he has to find it. Uh oh, it's live. The referees blew down the puck. There was a shot on net, the rebound was to be had, it got chipped, looked like it just went across the goal line, and then the refs blew the whistle. I don't know, maybe if the net was off, that look, looks like what it was. So they're calling net off, and that's why the puck was, uh, the whistle was blown. Looked like a dangerous opportunity. The shot was originally taken by number 19, Sullivan, and there was a uh, rebound to be had. Okay, draws one. It's at the high wall, thrown back down deep by Northbridge. Chipped aside. They've got puck control here. They get a shot from the point. It is deflected, but knocked away. That looks like that was deflected by number 24, Tommy Watts. Tom Watts is a freshman, brother of Jack Watts, and he's out on the ice for the first time tonight. It goes all the way back deep. That's going to be Watts. Tom Watts in pursuit. It goes to throw the body. Turned over. Puck is behind the net. Grace has got control. He's in his corner. He's carrying it up the wall. He's bodied and it's turned over. But he's able to win the draw. To he have a good play up. They've got Watts breaking in on a breakaway. Watts. Oh! Gets a good shot away on the glove. And Menard makes the save. 
good look for the uh, Jack Watts captain late in the second period. Menard turns him away on a breakaway. That's Tom Watts. Tom Watts with his head up, puts it up the middle, goes all the way through the zone. Ricketts, Ricketts says the puck battling two Northbridge players. He comes out with it, chips it from behind the net, but Menard is able to cover it up. We got 8.8 .8 seconds remaining in the second period. The draw will be deep in the Northbridge zone. Opportunity here for Foxborough. If they can get a face-off win, maybe they can uh, create an offensive opportunity. Puck is won by Ricketts. Shot along the side by Axon. It does come outside the blue. Koviado has got it. Sullivan's got it. He's going to dump it in, and that's going to end the period. So at the end of two, the score is Foxborough 2, Northbridge 1. Foxborough had a nice period there. They were able to get two goals, uh, to one from Jack Watts and the second from Ben Ricketts. And Josh Marcu looks solid in net um, throughout the second period. So with that, we'll sign off, and we'll uh, join you for the, uh, the final third period.
Welcome back. Getting ready to start the third period. 2-1 Foxborough. 15 minutes to go. Nice little bit of holiday cheer in the background. I'm underway in the third period. Buck taken by Callahan, and we have a gate open. <laughs> so, it's the right thing to do. I whistle it down, I gotta get that gate, gate closed. You don't want someone going through there and getting injured. So we'll do a redo, we're back at center ice. Only five seconds went off the clock. And we're underway, once again. Marcus Tello chips it on the side. Matt Grace working in pursuit. Good battle on the wall. Puck comes up high. Callahan's got it. Tries to get it through. The rebound's there. Watts is on it. So we had Watts with the shot. Tommy Marcusell was going for the rebound. It looks like they're going to call him. Yeah, it looks like Marcusell is getting a penalty. We'll have to see what the call is. He did run into the goalie. I think he was just trying to play the rebound. We'll see what the call was. So that's going to put Northbridge on the power play. 14.39 to go in the third period. Marc Asselo is the one that went to the box for two. I'm not quite sure what the call was. If it was goaltender interference, that might be the call. Draws deep in the puck's zone. The puck is won by Grace. Sicken by Pothier. He throws it up the wall. It is kept in and turned around quickly by Sullivan. Flanders has it. He tips it in to Sullivan. Sullivan in the high slot. Good block there. Grace felt that one. He felt it as he's going off. Ricketts will come on to join Jack Watts up front to try to kill this penalty off. And now Derek Axon hops on to join Ben Ricketts. That's turned over. That's Flanders. Flanders is working up. Flanders still got the puck. Oh, he broke through. Gets a good look. There's a rebound. Saved by Marcou. Puck is getting deep in the corner. Flanders has been uh, all over the puck here in this power play so far. Goes up to the wall. Numella keeps it in. He passes it to Flanders. Flanders with a shot. Good save. There's a rebound. Another save. Oh, two nice saves by Josh Marcou. Northbridge breaks in with two great opportunities. The initial shot and then the second one was turned away. So they're regrouping. 28 moves it up. That's Sullivan. Sullivan's going to drop it, and it's chipped by Axon, still in the zone. Ricketts turns around, turns it out to the, into the middle zone. Oh, boy. <laughs> Referee's talking to coach Mark Cedarchuk. I think I saw a unsportsmanlike signal by the referee. Looks like Marcus has got the penalty. Someone has to jump over to serve that portion for him. It's going to be a misconduct. It's not going to cause them to lose another player, but Marcus will be out for 10 minutes with a personal misconduct. So it remains five on four for Northbridge for another 37 seconds. And there's 13 minutes and 15 seconds to go in the third period. Foxborough leading two to one. Draw gonna be taken between Grace and Falcon. Falcon wins it. It's chipped in deep. Falcon's got it. He chips it over to Harrigan. Harrigan tries to go back, broken up by Keneally, and the puck is cleared from the zone. Numella, Numella carrying it through. He's got it into the zone. He's taking it deep into the corner. Tries a little chip on, but Mar Marcuse to the task makes the save. Well, another draw deep in the Foxborough zone. 14 seconds remaining on the power play for Northbridge.
Puck is dropped, controlled by Keneally, and he's able to clear it all the way down the ice. That should kill the remainder of the power play for Northbridge. That's taken over deep by Lewis. He's chipped it up to the middle. Falcon coming over the line, puts it in deep. Power play has now ended, so they're back at full strength. We're playing five on five hockey with 12.28 to go in the third period. Keneally moves it up to the side to Watts. Long pass, that's Hayes, he's got control. He's able to chip it in deep. Connor Hayes, nice little body check. Oh, and the puck just hops over Keneally's stick at the blue line. He'll retreat back to his end. Foxborough will regroup. Keneally throws it up to, to Hayes. Hayes has got control. Long pass up to Axon. Axon's looking for some support. Coviello's in the middle. He's banging his stick. Coviello now in deep. He's got control. He throws it out in front. Just misses Ricketts. It's broken up. Comes up the middle. Dangerous pass. Intercepted. But they're able to escape. And that's Flanders. He moves it up the wall, but it's chipped in by Callahan. Lewis throws it over to number Consigli. Back to Lewis. Lewis puts it through the neutral zone up to Numella. Numella throws it in deep. Callahan will have to take over. He does. He tries to chip up the wall to Hayes. Hayes has it in deep. Nice little move. Beats one player. It goes to Callahan up the wall. And Ricketts will carry it in. Turned back over by Northbridge. Really back-to-back -back play here in the third period. Nice little play by Callahan. He takes a shot. It goes wide. Puck's turned over. Numella. He dumps it in deep. Back and forth you go here in the third period in a close 2-1 game. Puck is kept in the zone. Oh, but there's a big body check there. Flanders gets a shot, but it's over the net. Intercepted. Oh, another big hit. Another big hit by Ricketts. Body checks are flying. All clean. Chipped in, and it's just chipped off the Miller stick. That'll reduce the icing. Up the wall to Watts. Watts goes for the long ball, and he just chipped away from Grace. That Grace wins it. He throws it out in front. There's no one there. Connor Hayes has it in the neutral zone. Chips it off the wall. Just misses. And he, and he turns it over again. Hayes throws it far side to Watts. Thoughts moves it up to Keneally. Keneally makes a move at the line. He's able to dump it in deep. Puck is retrieved by number five, Keneally. It comes up the wall. Sullivan Keneally at the point. Gets it through. No deflection. Dylan Pothier. He's dumped it in. It's retrieved by Shraft. Kept in at the line by Sullivan, but broken up. And they're turning it over with Kachuk. Kachuk throws it in. Marcou's got it. Marcou turns it over back to Kachuk. He's coming around wide. He's able to chip it in, but that's taken over by Keneally. Keneally goes wide side. Hayes, just a smart thing, dumps it in. He's looking for a change. Lewis dumps it up. Keneally takes it and one times it. Just misses the net. Dumped in deep by Coviello. Henry Diamond in pursuit. It's dumped down and we're going to have an icing. So it's an icing with 8.51 left to go here in the third period. Still a one goal game. Two to one. Hometown Fox for Warriors over the Northbridge Rams. Third period has been very well balanced I'd have to say. Both teams are carrying about similar amount of play. Um, again, it's a one goal game. Of course, Northbridge did have a power play, uh, but we're unsuccessful. Puck is just chipped out blue, past the blue line. Dumped back in by Keneally. It's turned over to Harrigan. Harrigan to Lewis. Lewis going up the middle. Intercepted. Oh, now it's intercepted by Axon. He's taken down. Oh, everybody was looking for a trip there. Doesn't look like that call is coming. Look like that player's stick got right in his skates, but no call comes. Hometown crowd absolutely thought that was going to be a trip. Derek Axon, whose who's, uh, skate was uh, interfered with the stick, he is questioning it. 
Coach Cedar Tech telling Derek, just plays over. No sense getting in misconduct. Call's not going to change at this point. Regroup. Puck's being dropped. Right side on Zach Menard. 8.23 remaining. One goal game. Well, the, the draw is won by Northbridge. They're coming out with some speed, but it's broken up nicely by Keneally at the center ice. Lewis, Lewis was looking for a bomb there. He was looking to spring Marino. Marino did get the puck and turned it in front, but unsuccessful. It's coming back with Ricketts. Ricketts clears the blue line, makes a nice move. He's in the slot. Ricketts, oh, just misses the opportunity from the slot over the net. Puck is dumped. They had to clear off the pressure there. What a good look. Nice opportunity. Ben Ricketts carried it over the blue line, brought it in a high slot. I don't know if it was deflected or it just went up high over the net. Next goal is crucial. Um, needless to say. So we're in a one goal game, 750 remaining. Puck deep in Northbridge zone. Matt Gray's taking a draw for Foxborough. One one by Northbridge. Number 27. Traft shoots it up. He's got turned over. Turned over to Hayes. Hayes is able to dump it in, but it's knocked down and turned back over by Schraff. Number 19. Oh, we had a battle at center ice and it fortunately didn't go through as a breakaway. Flanders is, Flanders is hit hard as he approaches the center ice. Watts. Watts coming in. Watts is still got it. He's going to dump it in the corner. He's in suit, but it's turned over and turned around by Strath. Up the wall and out. Number four. Took a hard hit there, Flanders, but he's still on the ice. He's up and at him. Seems to be no worse for the wear. Grace carrying it in. Gets it over the blue one. It's turned over. Puck goes up the middle. That will be an icing as well. 6.48 remaining here in the third. Score still 2-1 Foxborough over Northbridge in the season opener for the Foxborough Warriors varsity hockey team. Puck is just to the right side of Kanji. Excuse me, Menard. One by Foxborough. Deflected. No shot taken. Pucks into the neutral zone. Keneally oh, wins it up the wall, but it's turned over. Here's an opportunity by number nine and a block. What a nice block by the defenseman, Alex Coviello. That could have been a really, really good scoring opportunity. Watts turns it back down. He takes a low shot. That's saved by Menard. Watts has still got control. Oh, throws it across. It's tipped, but they still maintain control. Watts again. Watts has got the puck. Takes a rip, a good shot, but equally good save by Menard. Good puck possession by Foxborough there in that last shift. Watts, Grace, Watts was able to get a nice shot, but Menard was up to the task, and we're still at 2-1. Just over six minutes to play. The referee just having a discussion with Consiglia. Looks like he just needed to make an adjustment to his face mask. And we're ready for the draw. Ricketts wins the draw. Tries to get it in front. It's broken up. That's going to be Falcon. That's picked off in the middle by Henry Diamond. Turned over to Ricketts. Ricketts comes in. He's got a look. Off the blocker. Menard makes a blocker save. That was a dangerous opportunity. And we've got a gloved to head. Whistled down by the referee. Puck was gloved ahead, so they'll take that outside. Good opportunity for Ben Ricketts coming in. Got to the high slot. Ripped a pretty good shot, but Menard was able to get his blocker on it. Well, actually, it's coming all the way down. So it's going to come all the way down deep, just to the left of Josh Marcu. 5.57 remaining. In a closely contested 2-1 game.
Puck is one. Shot in the corner. Taken by Coviello. Trying to get it out. It's up to Axon. Axon's going to dump it in deep. Looks like we're getting a penalty here on that play. I think the uh, Northbridge player got up high on Axon as he dumped it in. Let's see what the call's going to be. It looks like roughing. Yeah, it's going to be a penalty to number 28, Chase Falcon. Of course, Falcon's not happy with the call. Comes at a pretty critical time with 5.37 remaining. His team down 2-1. to one. That puts Foxborough on a power play. Looks like Falcon's getting two for a rough. So let's see if Foxborough can take advantage. Get a critical uh, goal to go up by two here. Get themselves a little bit of breathing room. Bucks dump down the ice deep. They'll have to regroup. Keneally's got the puck in deep. He's going to set it up to Grace. Grace is going to start to carry it out. He's got some good speed. He's got great speed coming in the zone. He clears the blue. He drops it for Hayes, and he misses it. And a nice play by number 24, Evan Harrigan, who broke it up and got the uh, clear all the way down to the Foxborough zone. That's Dylan Pothier. That's a trip. Oh, and that is a trip. Okay, so now with 5.01 left, that's going to put Foxborough on a two-man advantage. It's going to put them up on a 5-on-3. They'll have that 5-on-3 for at least a minute and 25 seconds. This is a big part of the game. If you're Fox where you know you want to jump on this opportunity. Pothier was simply coming around the zone. And fortunate or not, the Northridge player got a piece of his uh, skates and it's a trip. So here we go, 5-on-3. Draw is 1-0. and oh, Big clear. That's a huge clear by number 19, Joe Sullivan. Critical seconds going off the clock. That's Coviello. Coviello is going to get it started for Foxborough. They're going to want to go gain the zone. That's Watts. They're going to want to gain the zone and set up. Take advantage of the extra players they've got. That's exactly what Watts does. He's got it to the point to Coviello. He lows it over to Keneally. Keneally takes a look. It's tipped nicely. Oh, that was set up nicely. They move the puck D to D. Sullivan Keneally gets the shot. Watts, he gets a tip on it. Just doesn't go through the goalie. Menard was up to the task on that deflection. All right, we've got 56 seconds remaining on the first penalty. 131 on the second. 4.32 to go in the game. And the puck is dropped. It's won by, it's won by Grace. He's got it back to Coviello. Throws it over to Keneally. Back across. Just missing. It's just chipped across the middle. Watts in pursuit. Watts has got control. Taking his time. Setting it up. Setting it up, moves it over. Coviello's got room. Walks in. He was looking for a backdoor pass. It just wasn't there. Keneally. Keneally brings it up the wall. He's behind the net. He loses control of the puck. Looking for a clear. Northbridge, 27. Schraff gets it. Oh, he almost sprung his player. Wow. Almost sprung him for a 5-on-3 shorthanded breakaway. Foxworth's got to get control back of the puck here. It's 13 seconds remaining on the two-man advantage. Coviello's got the puck. He puts it up to Watts. He drops it to Grace. Grace is coming in. He's going to set up. He's going to set up. Oh, he has a good look. He used that player for a screen and just missed the net. Kalini throws it at the net. That's out. Coviello has to chip it back in. They're going to have to clear the zone. That gives Northbridge time. Number 28. Falcon. Falcon has time to clear that down. 18 seconds left on the remaining penalty for Foxborough. Watts makes a nice move. Oh, but it's a great save by Menard. Watts came in over the line, tried to go up the short side, had a little bit of space on the short side, but Menard shut, Menard shut the door, excuse me. All right, here we are, 3.09, 2-1, nine seconds left on the power play for Foxborough. That was a, a big turnaround right there with a five on three opportunity. Foxborough not able to cash in on the five on three. That's going to give Northbridge time to regroup and uh, put together a push here in the last three minutes of the game. Down two to one. Draw deep in the zone. It's won nicely by Ricketts. Good shot at the point. That's number 24. That is Tom Watts. So freshman Tom Watts is getting a shift on the point. He's got it again. He's got it up the wall to Diamond. 
Diamond to Ricketts. Ricketts is breaking in. Battle in front of the net, trying to find it, but it's cleared. Northbridge is going to clear the puck. They're going to clear the zone. They've weathered the storm. Flanders is coming over the, the line. Nice shot deflected, or blocked, excuse me. 19 Sullivan took the shot. It was blocked. It's up high, down low. Sullivan's got it, but it's covered by Marku. Might argue an early whistle, but nonetheless, the puck is uh, covered up by Josh Marku. Wow, Northbridge with a push there. Sullivan, 19, got a couple good looks. Uh, 2.28 left. Let's watch the bench now and the goalie. And anticipate here in the next minute that they may pull the goalie and put the extra man on to try to get the tie and goal. Buck is won. There is a penalty coming. We have a penalty coming. It looks like it's going to be on Foxborough. Looks like it's Matt Grace. My guess is it's a high stick. That's what the indication was. Wow, that's going to create some drama. 2.24 left. 2-1 to Foxborough. Matt Grace is called for high sticking. He's going to put Northbridge on a power play. You would think if they don't score early on the power play that they will look to pull the goalie and try to get a two-man advantage. In any case, they've got control. It's Dumela. Call was slashing. I'm corrected. It was not high stick, but slide. shot from the side. Josh Marcu has it. So let's set it up. Two to one, Foxborough. Two minutes and ten seconds remaining in the third period. Northbridge is on a power play. We've got 147 left on that power play, and the puck is dropped, and it's in the corner. Callahan rings it, but it's taken over by number eight, Lewis. Lewis off the wall. Sullivan had control. He throws it wide to Numella. He moves to the middle. Was able to keep it in. Sullivan looks super wide. Oh, what a snare. Oh, what a play. What a save. Crucial save. Flanders on the back door. But Marku just snags it out of the air. 149 remaining, 126 on the power play for Northbridge. We're going to keep an eye on their bench. Their goalie is still in. They have control. Sullivan looks for that play again down low to Flanders. Numella has it. He's wheeling around the back of the net. It comes up the wall. Flanders has got it up high. Takes his shot. It's blocked by Callahan. It's tripped down the ice by Watts. They have to regroup and go in deep. Derek Lewis brings it up to Numella. Northbridge trying to come in the zone. Working Flanders. It's turned over. That's going to be Ricketts. Takes a shorthanded shot. Nice save. Uh-oh. Ricketts is down. He's still down. Puck is dumped in deep. And it is an icing. Let's go! Ben Ricketts is uh, talking to the ref. Wondering why there wasn't a call there. Looked like he might have got his stick lifted. All right, so we have 105 left in the third. 41 seconds left on the power play for Northbridge. On the kill right now is Jack Watts, Derek Axon, and there's the timeout. We expected to have a timeout. Not sure which team called it. Timeout, My guess is yes, it was Northbridge. Northbridge takes a timeout. Probably the smart play. Probably wants to rest his players. They've been out there the entire power play. They're looking at 105 on the clock, 41 seconds with this power play. Probably talking about getting uh, getting puck control, getting it in deep, and then we'll probably look um, to Menard in the net to see if he comes out and they take that extra man advantage. Foxborough is probably talking about what do we do? We want to win control. We want to keep the puck in deep. Don't give them the opportunity to get back down on our zone and get that goaltender out. So game one of the season, home, uh, season opener, home opener for Foxborough, and well, we've got a we've got a close one. We're going to have a little a little drama to come down at the end of the game here. So it's been a good one. The third period's been excellent, uh, real real well fought by both teams. Northbridge has had a couple power play opportunities. Um, in fact, Foxborough had a five on three, weren't able to capitalize, and now Northbridge sits on a uh, on a power play with a minute five left. So we're in for a pretty good finish here, I would say.
Puck's going to be to the right side of Menard, deep in Northbridge zone. You got Watts taking the draw. Derek Axon up on four with him. Alex Coviello, Sullivan Keneally on the point. Puck is dropped. It is one by Northbridge. They go all the way up the wall. The Flanders set play there. Clearly, Northbridge had the set play. They got the draw. Went for the big spring up the wall to Flanders, and it was just a little bit ahead of them. We'll do it again. 58.9 seconds in the game. 35 seconds left on the power play. Watts to take the draw against Falcon. Falcon wins it. They're going to do the same play. They spring it to Flanders. It's turned over. Axon throws it in deep. Watts is battling behind the net. Falcon has it. Falcon moves it up. It's just off Flanders' stick. Turned over in the mid zone. Axon's going to take the puck. You're going to want to keep it in deep. 15 seconds on the power play. Northbridge has not had the opportunity to pull their goalie yet. You've not got to think they're pulling him now. Watts has it at center ice. He's battling there with Numella. Numella comes out with it. Here comes Menard. The goalie is pulled. 20 seconds left. Northbridge is going to go with six men on five. Empty net. Battle in the corner. We have a penalty. Let's see what the call is. Well, it looks like Keneally of Foxborough is getting the call. He got a roughing call. All right, so we have Keneally gets a roughing call. 12.9 seconds left. Foxborough holding on to a 2-1 lead. Northbridge has the goalie out. We got empty net. And now they're going to be on another power play. This is going to be 6 on 4 for Northbridge with 12.9 seconds left. And Foxborough's called their timeout. Our left. Once again, Northbridge is on a power play. Penalty just went to Keneally. And they've pulled the goalie. So they've got the empty net, which will give them the extra player. So it's going to be six on four for Northbridge. Setting up this crucial draw. It'll be Grace for Foxborough. So it'll be a big draw. It's won by Grace. He's able to clear the zone. Slow rolling puck. Is it going to make its way? It doesn't matter. They're shorthanded. They're able to drive it in deep. Watsy's going to kill the clock. And Foxborough's going to be able to walk away with the victory. Home opening victory. Season opening victory. 2-1 to one is your final score for Foxborough. Not without a nice finish. Lots of drama. Northbridge gave it a big push at the end. Had a power play. Had the goalie pulled. Six on four. Matt Grace wins a big draw and is able to clear the zone, and Foxborough will skate away with the win. Well, with that, we'll uh, sign off again. This has been Keith Leach, joined by Chris Fasell on the camera. I want to thank him for his work tonight. We had a really good first game, and we'll uh, see you the next time. Wishing everybody a good night and a good rest of the weekend. Take care.